Hey everyone, Tom here. Welcome back today. We are back with Cobra Kai Season 4. We're on Episode 5, Match Point. What does it say here? Johnny and Daniel's dojo and their fragile alliance teeter on the brink of collapse when they agree to a winner-takes-all sensei showdown. This is going to be awesome, and this is what I was wondering about from the original teaser trailers, was when you have that scene with Johnny and Daniel matching up at the competition, whether or not that was just a promo shot, and obviously not, so it's obviously the way that the show is going to go. Looking forward to seeing that. The last episode was really interesting to listen to Terry, and you can tell he's still got his devious ways, but he really does want to just take the Cobra Kai students and make them the best versions of themselves as his fighters, and obviously he's not so worried about this whole revenge thing that Kreese has. So it's going to be good to see what comes of that. So yeah, let's get straight in and see what happens. I mean, I think at the end of that last episode, Johnny and Daniel were about to have a few words about things, and that's obviously fueled mainly by... Johnny's jealousy of everything, especially to do with Daniel and Miguel and all the rest of it. But anyway, guys, let's get into this episode and see what it's all about. Daniel LaRusso. It's nice to see you again. Bullshit. My past behavior was... inexcusable. All I can say now is... I'm truly sorry. I'm not that man anymore. No idea. It looks like a Highlander. The Highlander. Does look like a Highlander. We'll still hold our students to a moratorium on fighting before the tournament for what it's worth. Provided, of course, you do the same. Now get the hell out of here. Daniel still holds things close to his chest. Sign out front says Miyagi do. Unless you want to cram up your ass sideways, you better take off after your bridge partner. Nice, Johnny. Nice. Chris is just so good at sowing those seeds of doubt in everyone's mind. Now, we get to work. <laughs> but at least he's trying to do it by making the best fighters, so. They know you and I are the biggest threat, but they also know we can't risk violating probation. We just had a little powwow with the senseis of Miyagi-Do. So our enemies get to humiliate us and we just have to back down and take it? Of course not. No need to waste a punch if it's not going to score a point. Take all that anger and store it. Because you're going to need it when the time comes. Yes, yes, sir. Good advice. He could actually lead them to victory so much more so than Crease. Crease is too busy going to war with everyone, going to war with little kids all the time. So that's when Mr. Miyagi agreed to take me back. So let me get this straight. The year after our title fight, they put you straight through to the finals. I'm telling you, Silver knows how to fight. The game has changed, and we need to change with it. Which is why I need to take over our students' training from now on. So Miyagi Do defeated Silver last night. Doesn't mean it's gonna work this time. Silver's a psychopath, all right? You cannot strike first with this guy. Look, I just want what's best for Miguel and all of your students. Oh, so now you know what's best for Miguel, huh? I'm Come on, Johnny. You think one win by 1.30 years ago makes you better than me? Johnny. I was Cobra Kai's number one student. If anybody knows how to beat them, it's me. Yeah, and how are you gonna do that? They strike first, you strike firster. Yeah, well, I'm not gonna <laughs> I'm afraid I'm gonna have to ask you to keep it down. Shut the fuck up. Beat it. Whoa. You and me, tournament style. First three points wins. And takes over the kids' train. Tournament style, okay. Tomorrow. Sundown on the sparring deck. At least they're actually gonna do it properly. Come on, Johnny, though. Really? It was only three dollars. Just, just put his drinks on my tab. Bit of a shame, really. Johnny's got a, still got a bit of ego about him. Had a few ups and downs, but still turned out pretty rich. How'd you even find out his name? I took a picture at the dojo, then found an old facial recognition beta test and... I love it when you talk nerdy. You oh, she's back. <laughs> Just found out my dad's wedding is going to be in Sydney. That means I won't be here for prom or the tournament. Oh. But I'll still root for you. That's cool. That's such an unlikely matchup. Later, guys. Yo. You guys won't believe this. Sensei got drunk and went on a Twitter rant. It looks like he and Sensei LaRusso are going to have a rematch. So this is real? Sensei and Sensei are gonna throw down. Mm -hmm. That's awesome! Daniel. He's sleeping it off. <laughs> Anything you wanna tell me? I thought you and Johnny were finally past all this. So did I. This guy had me in an arm bar like he was Hoist Gracie and I was... me. He took down two bikers, me, and I had a bat. No, okay, guys. <laughs> Thank you. They're gonna be doing a points match. It's a bit safer. What happened? Terry Silver happened. Another one. Seriously, Daniel? 
Well, I just need Johnny to take a step back and give me the rings. Mm, let me guess, you told him as much. He didn't like that. We'll sort this out. We just, the booze got the better of us both. Mm. He's training for his glory. Oh, he's tough as fuck, though, isn't he? <laughs> hey, we both said some things we regret. I um, don't apologize. It shows weakness. Ah, uh, there you go. I don't apologize. It shows weakness. Everybody at school's talking about the fight. Oh, great. So what'd you do to set him off? What did I do? I've tried to make this work, and Johnny's impossible. No, he's not. He's just has a different style. It's not a different style. It's the wrong style. Is this have something to do with the guy who showed up at the dojo with Chris? Yeah. So right now, we have to double down on Miyagi-Ko. So what, no more Eagle Fang? Johnny's never gonna go for that. That's how this whole thing started. We were... But don't worry, there's not gonna be any fight. Of course not. Miyagi-Ko is all about avoiding fights whenever possible. Johnny says if we keep taking shit from Cobra Kai, they're gonna keep coming at him. I just wanna learn both styles. So... Your mom told me about the birthday party. It seems you're the one doing the instigating now. But you know we don't believe in aggression. That's not how we act. But I can make my own decisions. Nice, Sam. That's awesome. Desire, yes. devotion, yes. and discipline. I understand you want to defeat your enemies. Until then, just stay focused on your training. Yes, Attention, chill. I'm kidding. He wants to win the proper way. It sucks we can't give a beat down before the tournament. I think I've got a counter to Larusso's bread and butter. I slip under, shoulder check him to the balls, take him to the mat, elbow, elbow, elbow. <laughs> Point. Lawrence, winner. Honestly, Sensei, I kind of just wish you weren't fighting at all. So if you win, we just train Eagle Fang. There's no Miyagi, though. You got it, Pontiac. I guess the way I see it, no matter who wins, nobody wins. Okay, Sensei. Well, good luck, all right? Students just want to learn, man. There's nothing wrong with knowing both styles. I thought if we taught together, we could make the kids stronger. Yeah, but you haven't. You've been arrogant. Doesn't really care about anything else. I tried to put aside the past. It's only a matter of time before somebody gets hurt. His ideas are dangerous. His ideas are sort of realistic as well in some ways. I just hope that you'll forgive me. Bring us whatever bottle of scotch your boss has stashed for special occasions. And I want you to know I'm glad you came on board. But I want to make sure that we're both on the same page. Cobra Kai never backs down from a fight. We always strike first. But you already did. I'm talking about Robbie Keane. You never told me his father was Johnny Lawrence. You stole the man's son. If that's not a direct attack, I don't know what is. Good I point. Him and the rest of the kids wrapped up in all your old drama. I've got everything under control. That's not how it looks from where I'm sitting. Where you were sitting was at a vegan tofu brunch. With billions of dollars in his bank account. Nothing wrong with that who I was along the way. Now, there's nothing I want more than a second chance at finishing what we started. And the only way to do that is to forget about the past. LaRusso will have to shut down Miyagi-Do. Johnny Lawrence will rue the day he ever left Cobra Kai. Yeah, so he's still got revenge in him. He just wants to do it the right way. Chris will never really fully go for it, though. Hey, Rico, you good? Come on, Hawk. You want that hard to find you, bitch. You assholes just ignoring the no fighting rules. Definitely an intense episode. What are all the kids doing here? That's what happens when you broadcast your life all over social media. Right, look, maybe there's a better way. There is. Don't you ever think you might be wrong? What's best for them is Miyagi Do. All right, Luiso. Let's finish this. You can definitely see Daniel's point of view having a traditional system with so much history and, and I also believe Johnny. Fight! Nice kicks, Johnny. Point, Lawrence. So say Lawrence, right first. True to the motto painted on his former dojo wall. <laughs> These guys. Trying to capture the spirit of the, the thing. Students just want to learn everything. They sound like they're going full ham on each other. Ready? 
Oh, here we go. Come on, give Johnny at least another point. Thank Johnny, don't always attack. Hell, man. Danny was gonna use his nerve shit. I'm not the one fighting dirty. You are fighting dirty. Next point wins. Fight. Come on, Johnny. Being on the attack makes you vulnerable in some ways. Oh! I think Johnny's gonna lose being on the attack so hard. Double knockout. I wonder if that was going to happen. Check the replay. Go to another angle. There is no other angle. <laughs> Shit, Eli, what happened? Who did this? Cobra guy. Crease and Silver did this. They need to pay. Crease tried to kill you last time. What do you want to fight them both? You were so proud when they pulled their little sprinkler prank the other day. But if they stood their ground and kicked some ass like I taught them, this never would have happened. Come on, just because you spent your share of time with both. Dad. Johnny's right. If we don't strike back, they're going to keep coming at us. Is this what you want, Johnny? No, you don't have to worry about it anymore. We're saving civil words, though. That's a change. Let's go. Such a shame. But at least they were civil about it. Better than the previous uh, arguments and things they've had. It's definitely a lot of time to be dividing their, their strength, though. Now, that was definitely a cool episode. Um, interesting to see that Terry still does want to do things the right way. Obviously, he's going to be training hard and using actual tactics and things or whatever he can to, to win, but he wants to win properly. He wants to actually just prove that Cobra Kai is the best by being the actual best. Interesting to see that Johnny, although he had a little bit of jealousy in that, he took it seriously. He still expected there to be honor in that match. When Daniel started using the pressure points, he was like, what the fuck's going on here? And it was really good to see that. And I think in this episode, it really did pinpoint or highlight uh, Daniel's single track mind. You know, he's very un unwavering and unfaltering in his system, which is fair enough. You know, it kind of makes sense that he'd be that dedicated to the system. I mean, there are a few people trained by Miyagi. I feel sorry for the students, you know, being split and having to basically been pulled back to their respective dojos when really they can see what Daniel and Johnny don't see, which is the benefit of cross-training. And I'm interested to see what retribution happens with the Cobras for what they did to Hawk. But anyway, guys, thanks for joining me. Feel free to put any tips and hints and stuff or your thoughts in the comments down below. I always appreciate that. Uh, but that's all for me for now, guys. So until the next one, take it easy.